Okay, in this video, I wanted to do uh, a bit of a dedication. This is for uh, Weapons and Stuff 93. Uh, he, uh, I had been talking to him in one of his live streams and uh, I had said to him about the PDRM82D and I just thought I would do this video just to show him the PDRM82D in a bit of detail. So as you can see, it's exactly the same as the, uh, the Plessy PDRM82. And uh, Plessy designed a range of uh, handheld dose rate meters for uh, UK Civil Defence and the Royal Observer Corps. Uh, from about 1981 that they started um, the development phase of, uh, of manufacturing a couple of different meters, uh, which eventually became what we all know as the PDRM82, which I have here. So everyone knows the PDRM82. Now, after the PDRM82, they developed the PDRM82F, and this is a fixed version, uh, and it had an external probe that's screwed onto the end here on a uh, large coaxial cable, and then that could be used in Royal Observer Corps monitoring posts, and it could also be used in local council control bunkers as well. They could extend the, uh, the cable up onto the surface, onto the main street or whatever, and that could get their radiation readings. And then as well as that, there's the PDRM82M, which is the military version, the green one. Um, you do you can pick these up from time to time. The PDRM82F comes in a kit and they're about 250 quid. Uh, these come up for sale every so often and I've seen them go for, from anywhere from 30 up to about 60. Uh, but again, works exactly the same as the normal PDRM82. Now the difference with the PDRM82D is it has a sounder module and it also has a wand and again it does uh, gamma only. So as you can see it measures 0 0.0000 centigrade per hour so you're able to uh, do check sources with this and you know small contaminated bits and pieces. So what I'll do is now I'll do my usual jump cut and uh, I'll show you it working with a, with a couple of uh, check sources. Okay, so we'll do the uh, usual bit of pitch blend because most people can get their hands on this stuff. In fact, in fact I'll put that there. I'll tilt the, tilt the display up and then I'll probably zoom in on the display so that you can see it a bit better. Now this only does, it's, it's not the most sensitive meter in the world. Uh, these were developed for the Royal Air Force and uh, these were last used in Iraq and Afghanistan. And as you can see as well, it's manufactured by Siemens. Uh, Siemens bought over Plessy and for a while they were known as Siemens Plessy and uh, then they dropped the Plessy name and just went with Siemens. But uh, this was the last uh, Geiger counter that uh, Siemens ever produced. First and last Geiger counter. Right, we'll go for the Mr. Radium, Mr. Radium dial out of the P63. And again, I'll put that there and I'll zoom in onto the display. Just a bit of a difference. But yeah, pretty cool. Um, I paid 200 for this and they do come up from sale for sale from time to time. Sometimes for ridiculous money, but they do come up for sale and they're well worth getting because it's a PDRM82 that you don't need to, in the case of weapons and stuff, 93, you don't need to stick, you know, 2,000 pounds worth of uh, radium dials and stuff around it to get it to do anything. But yeah, it's a pretty cool meter. And uh, yeah, if you're into Geiger counters, you know, it's a cool thing to have. Uh, probably one of the last Cold War era Geiger counters um, that was still used by the military up until quite recently. But listen, as always, thank you very, very much for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.